G'day. I've come down here to Macra, which is a beach, a bay, or kind of like an outdoor coastal reserve near to where I live. And the reason I've come down here is to give the Mini SE its first flight. And I struck it lucky actually, because it's usually so, so windy down here. But today it's pretty calm. And when I arrived, there was this awesome mist just like leaving out through the bay, which is pretty cool to see. But I am quite amped to see how I get on with this drone flight. Invariably things go wrong for me, but uh, generally it comes right in the end. So let's just get it up and see how it goes. I'll just make sure I'm getting some audio here, which I am. But yeah, when I first came down here, there's just this sheet of mist just escaping from the inlet from the bay. And it was just too good. And I thought it was gonna be relatively calm down here, but it is actually still quite windy. I oh, will give it a go. Whew, I tell you what, it is freezing though down here. Freezing. Okay, let's do this. Okay guys, well, I walked all the way up this hill to make sure the drone doesn't get lost out here in the Pacific Ocean, Jemuan and Nuiakiwa. Come and have a look. Wow, incredible, eh? Look at this, right on our doorsteps right here. Unbelievable. We're so lucky here to have the Pacific Ocean and these wonderful coastal cliffs right in our very backyards. Pretty sweet, hey? And the Mini SE is handling this terrain and this wind like a boss. I'm still gonna try and keep it inland a bit because I am like, I don't wanna lose it in the ocean on the first couple of days I've got it. But hey, look at this spot. And this here is Macra. Macra Beach. Macra Beach is just behind that point there. Okay, I'm getting worried now because I don't know what the wind's doing up there. I guess it would tell me. But of course I could always put it in sport mode. Let's see if that makes it go faster. Wow. Okay, sport mode is tracking. So let's bring it back to where I am. I'm just right there in that sort of dip in that valley. And we're gonna come in hot here. All right, I think I've managed to get it back safely this time. Okay, so there we go. That was the first flight with the DJI uh, Mini SE. It was just like flying a drone, but it's such a beautiful spot down here. The main thing I get worried about is the wind. Like it's resisting the wind the whole time. But for some reason I have this irrational thought that the wind is just gonna suddenly grab it from nowhere and just swoosh it out to the Pacific Ocean, way out there, no longer to be seen, but it didn't eventuate. And uh, you just have to keep a good eye on it, I guess when the wind starts building up to lower the altitude because the wind's a little bit lower depending on the altitude in some cases and then bring it back to you as proficiently as you can and of course if you're filming in like cine mode or p mode what does p stand for uh, then the option is to pop into sport mode so you've got that extra headway into the wind but yeah uh look i didn't test it to its limits here because i'm probably not going to test it to its limits i mean it'd be nice to but generally speaking, testing to the limits means there's the opportunity for it to go too far. 
But hey, it was pretty cool. I had one battery. I got a good solid half hour flying out of it. So I think that's pretty good. Uh, that was quite fun actually. I'm sure I got some lovely shots. Anyway, that's it. That was the first flight with the Mini SE. How about that? Hopefully it's still recording. Yep, beauty.